Now it is on to 1985, and again, Thomas Hearns involved in one of our great rounds of all time. This time, going up against Marvinus and Marvin Hagler. Of course, so customary before these fights. And here we go, round one. Hagler, right off the bat, Attempting to get inside. He'd love to be able to pin Hearns on the ropes if he can. A more aggressive start by Hagler. Look at him right for the body. Marvin Hagler only wants the body, and he bangs Marvin. Oh, Hearns may have hit him with the right hand. Hearns hit him the right. Hearns hits him with an uppercut. Hagler, he's hurt. 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 Hagler is stunned. Hearns got inside. Hit him with a right uppercut. Marvin ties him up. Marvin Hagler is still hurt. So it was Hagler coming out like a bullet. A good left by Hagler, but Hearns didn't flinch. Marvin going for the body. Wild first round. Wow, what a shot. And it was Hagler who initiated it, not Thomas Hearns. And a left by Hagler. Hagler. Hearns comes back. Another right. That one stunned Hearns. What a first minute of the fight. Tommy Hearns has been able to drop that right hand in, and it has hurt Hagler, a surprise to many people. Another right hand from Hearns. Hearns moving. Hagler still pursuing, comes in with a right. Missed him with a left hook. Here's where I believe Hagler should turn to righty. He could block that right hand easier and he would land his own left hook. Hearns with a devastating punch. Swelling near Hagler's left eye. Again, Tommy trying to come inside the hands of oh, Hagler. Low blow by Hearns. Hagler's still looking for the body. A right by Hagler. Good right got in. He has Hearns where he'd love to keep him on the ropes, but Tommy comes off oh. easily. Another good right by Hearns. Hagler is now shaking those right hands off, though, Al. He was stung a little early, and he's normally a slow starter. He's also bleeding. Hagler is cut. Hagler is cut. Bridge of the nose. Hagler hitting him low. He is banging the body well. He is taking shots to the head. He blocks that right. Hearns tries to come in with the uppercut, and Hagler ties him up with a minute to go in a wild first round. I don't think I've ever seen a first round like that. That is incredible pace from bell to bell. A Angelo, how can, a, how can two people so heavy, such heavy punchers, land so accurately and still have no effect? They were just going at each other. This may have been the finest night of Tommy Hearns, a losing night. He was fantastic that night. He just met a determined Marvin Hagler who stood up to every shot he got nailed and came back for some. That was a great, great first round. I really, do you think I, that's I was the amazed best? how good Tommy Hearns was that night. Do you, do you fellas think that's the best opening round between two champions at peak condition ever? I would say, I would say it was. It's one of the most active ones that I've seen. It is probably the most active one I've seen. Can, do you remember anybody starting that fast no, and keeping it up for three rounds? Not, not in any class. Wait. Not in any class, not in any time. Was, but was there boxing uh, skill, guile here, or was this a barroom fight? Was this two guys going as hard as they know how? You know, in this fight, I know just what was on uh, Hagler's mind. You know, Hagler knew, or at least he thought, because he had seen Hearns get knocked out a couple times. And he had the feeling that Hearns didn't have a, the best chin in the world. Now, listen, he really felt that Hearns didn't have the best chin in the world. So what he did was shot dice. I'll buy that, but I also buy the fact that that same set of dice was shot 
by Hearns. Because well, Hearns came out and said, let me, this, let me do this now, because uh, I ain't going to do it later. Uh, and, and, I mean, he got in and, there and early. In a dice game like that, if you got any man about you, you got to fight back. You yeah. know what I mean? This is, what, and this is what he made him do. And, you know, he put him into what he wanted him to be in, a, a, a war, a dogfight. In yeah. other words, you thought Hagler called that shot. Hagler 